Hey everyone, what's up? It's Fana. Welcome back to the channel. Today we're playing some uh, we're playing some Anna. Ranked, of course. Uh, we're in Masters right now, dude. We're close to a season high. This game will not get me the season high, but it'll get me close. Um, oh, well, that got me good, didn't it? I'm just gonna nade myself on this one so I can keep going. Let's have a look around. So now I'm against a DPS player. Um. It's not going to happen, my friends. Made that one a little bit obvious, didn't he? Oh, somebody left the game. Why are we always getting people to leave the game? This has happened in like the last three YouTube videos, man. I don't understand. It's really weird, dude. So now we're coming into Havana. Anna got taken. And uh, I mean, I want to play Mercy, but... Every time I want to go Mercy these days, like, no one's picking, like, good Mercy pocket targets. Like, there's no Widowmaker, there's no McCree, there's no Soldier, like, there's no Hanzo. It's just, like, Sombra. Well, I'm not going to be boosting Sombra. She's going to be on the other side of the map. I'm going to give her away on invisibility. Uh, that leaves me with Doomfist, who's going to be flying all over the place. Um, that's going to be a bit of a nightmare. So then it's, like, leaves me with Zaya, who's, you know, a great boost target, but... Not exactly amazing. Uh, what's this guy on about? We get the lamp in there. The lamp, the lamp, the lamp. A little bit too much, though. Okay. Not sure what the Doomfist was on about. He said in team chat, I will now die. And then he died. So that's interesting. Don't know if he's like just being silly or if he's what he's up to. So I mean, I'll say we keep an eye on it, but it doesn't really matter that much, I guess. You know, whether he plays or not. Oh my god, she got one shot. I'm really trying to heal. Yeah, we're gonna go in here, boys. Wait, oh, the lamp went down fast. Oh my god. Okay, they got walls here, so I need to be a little bit careful. I do have uh, fields coming in. Just a bit scared of that widow. Oh. Anna on the kill. The Anna seems to be DPSing a bit, so that's actually a good thing since we're playing Anna Baptiste. The. Uh, if both of us were just like main healing, it would honestly become kind of a problem of having too many heals and not enough damage. So we got, we got Anna over there. Yeah, she's kind of DPS and I don't mind it at all. I kind of like it to be honest. Keep her alive yeah. It's been a while since I played Batman. In fact, I don't even think I played the uh, Baptiste this season at all yet, so. This is kind of interesting. Just don't want to pick Mercy where I can't damage boost, you know? Um, let's have a look here. So I got Tracer. Tracer's kind of nasty for Baptiste. Because Baptiste is so thick, it's really easy for Tracer to hit shots. Oh my god, he got me there? Wow. That's how thick I am, dude. Check out how thick I am. Mega thick, dude. Mega. All right, we got um, field coming back here. The fight's looking a bit dodge. People going down. The enemy team got rezzed. It's like three versus five right now. Um, we're going to have to make a decision on this field very quickly. The decision is probably going to be... No. It'd be really silly to field there, I think. Are oh, you hoping for like the biggest of plays? Oh, Hawk's still going at it. EMP. Okay, this is where we field for sure. You nearly tuck it down. <laughs> Poor guy, man. Let's get a heal down on this arm, bro. All right, that's not too bad. It's not too bad. I'm like tempted to switch away, but I'm not hating it. I'm just 
kind of uncomfortable because I haven't played much BAP this season. I need to be adding some DPS to the team as well. Like, if you're going to play BAP Ana, it's... The ideal situation is that you both do add damage to the team. It's just kind of awkward because you got to try and, like, figure out... You know, how much healing is Ana doing? How much healing is Baptiste doing? Oh, no way. What? Makes sense, Roadhog. Any little bit of sense, make it. Oh, no. Oh, she sucked us into the pulse. I'm actually going to send Yata here. Because... They've got a Roadhog. If we have Ana Zen... The only worry is the Tracer. But I'm going to be honest. This Tracer doesn't scare me that much right now. That's just right now. Like, the story could change, you know, very quickly. Oh. Oh, yeah, she's done. We got field here. I think I'm going to go chuck it on the corner. Are you kidding me, dude? I think he just threw that out of nowhere. Like, he was aiming for the Zyre, maybe. Yeah, he's all the Zyre, and I just moved into it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's good Roadhog, man. Alright, we'll go with Field into the next one. We could pop it early as well. Like... Mm. No, that would be very early. I don't know about that. Let's get back a bit here. Like I said, not too scared of the Tracer. Oh, nice. I kind of want to feel where Anna can shoot through it as well, to be honest. Anna's DPSing hard, so... Oh my god, she's probably got pulse. Never mind, she's dead. We need to touch this. Can anybody touch? Alright, he's on. Try and keep Zyra alive. Now, do I want to go Zenyata here, man? Let me think for a second. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go Zen. I don't know, man. It's It's been a while since I've honestly played anything but... Wait, we got, we got Widow now. I'm gonna play Mercy here. While I don't love Widow as a pocket target in this situation, we can just keep rezzing her and uh, with a damage boost as well, she's gonna dominate the enemy Widow. I should really like this. Finally, someone to pocket, dude. That's what you like to see. Now, I do want to go heal my Ana. She's, she's hit, but like she's also not in trouble. So there's that. I don't think she's ever going to be in trouble. Except that hamster, maybe. That hamster might want to come through. I wonder if we can... Uh, sneak a res off here, dude. No, that was not a good idea. <laughs> Should have fell back with the Widow there, probably. But then again, then again, if I fell back with the Widow, no one would have been able to touch the point anyway, so I don't think that decision mattered too much. Okay, going on attacky, dude. We got Ash this time. We're going to give her the blue beam. She's going to have a good time. We got a McCree as well. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, Hog, Zaya, McCree, Ash, Anna. Um, ooh, ooh. Yeah, I want to be with the Ash. Yeah, that's why we want to be with the Ash. There's no better pocket target than an Ash when you're on Mercy, dude. Like, it's just it's just a dream. Like, it's so incredibly powerful that you just don't want anything else. It's literally the dream. This Trace is going to have a bad time because I'm just going to hard pocket the, uh, the Ana. She's going to die, right? Like, surely she dies. She's still in there. On the right side. Let's see if McCree takes care of her or not. Okay, Ash. Keep the pocket on the Ash. We hide in the room for now. Nice. We got to kill that. My Anna's in trouble, so we're gonna we're gonna help her out here. It's all about just keeping Anna alive and keeping the blue beam on Ash and McCree as much as possible. It's uh, it's fairly simple, honestly. You know, use the walls to my advantage. Make sure they can never get to me. 
You know, in terms of pocket ash and McCree, like, I prefer to pocket ash, but, like, if either of them is further forwards, it's going to be worth, like, pocketing the person who is further forward if it's safe for me to pocket that person. Like, it's basically, I want them to be within line of sight of the enemy so that you know, I know my blue beam is always getting value or as much value as possible. And here, we're getting mad value, dude. L look at this guy go, dude. Britsy, the legend, on the ash. He can't be stopped. He can't be stopped. I got Valk ready to go. Um, no more Tracer. you love to see it. That makes it about a thousand times easier for us. We got to stand on cart here, though. This is a great push so far. I feel like we'd... I feel like... You know, at this point, this is where you're in the game. You're like, dude, this is definitely going to round two. It might not necessarily do that. That's like full cockiness level right there. But like, oh, oh, back on the tracer, dude. Okay. Didn't expect that. Let's try and keep the Ash alive. She's taking a lot of heat though. All right, we're going to get out of here. See, I knew it wasn't confirmed, dude. Now, uh, now our boys, uh, talking crap in the chat. That That's an issue. Alright. Burnt Soda. Let's get him hooked up with some heals. Anna's back, so we're gonna try and get back to our damage boost targets. Let Anna take care of the healing if she can. I hear a tracer. That's, uh, that's not a good... Oh, my God. This guy with his five kill, dude. We just got absolutely ravaged. Oh, we just lost Hog along the way as well, which kind of sucks. All right, let's see what Britsy can do here. Go on, Britsy. You've done it before. You can do it again. I fully believe in Britsy to just pop off here, to be honest. Oh, that got me, dude. Dude, I got a song stuck in my head. It goes... This guy's called Savage Love, and it's got a melody that's like some synth-based synth uh, trumpet, and it just... It's one of those synth trumpets that sounds kind of dumb, but also kind of just sticks in your head. It's like... Beep, 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 do, 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 oh, we gotta trace to the back, yeah? It just like burnt into my brain meat so hard that I just can't even think of anything else. I'm like trying to commentate the game. Oh, guys, we got Valkyrie coming up. Beep, boop, boo. Boo, da, 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 boop, boo. Um, Hog, you okay? I'm also asking if you're okay on that Graviton that just went out. I don't know where that went. Britsy, I got you. Don't even worry about it. I got you as well. Nobody's gonna die to a Tracer around here. I'll tell you that. She's trying to take on three people right now. She's got the biggest of dreams. Let's keep it moving. Maybe dreaming just a little bit too big. But you know, you don't want to be that guy who's like, somebody's got some dreams and you're like, well, ha, you got no chance. In this case, though, I am that guy. You've absolutely got no chance there, Tracer. It's not going to happen. You got to pick the battles that you can win. I got to stay on car a little bit. I don't know. Anna keeps leaving car, so it's kind of weird for me to go forward. I need to keep the push going. Okay, she seems to be staying on. I'm watching you carefully, though, Anna. Apparently not carefully enough. Oh, dude, behind the re car res. That's what we're talking about. That's the good stuff right there. Keep Britsy alive at all costs. Who's going up? Britsy. Oh, dude, just as I jumped. Uh, Brits has fallen asleep. Britsy, wake up. We got this. I don't want to pocket the Widow or the McCree. It's okay. We go again, Britsy. You know what, Britsy? I believe in you. We conquer these failures. We come back. We fight. We keep it going. And we keep believing, Britsy. God damn it, Britsy. We're down. Um, That's okay. And we try again. We try again. Okay, we got Torbjorn now. We got Torbjorn and Sombra. Things are switching up fast out here, dude. It's a it's a hero switch every time we die. We've also got Winston now as well, dude. Yeah, we're switching all over the place here. Uh, let's boost the nano to Winston here. Let's 
going on in here? Oh my god, that's a Nano Zarya. Trying to pump the team full of heals. I do want to get the res here. Hopefully not at the cost of my Winston. He's getting healed right now. Oh my goodness. Oh, we're all down, dude. There's no way. There's no way, dude. That Zarya just went huge right there, dude. Alright, GG. A little bit sad to not be on the Ana there, dude. I've been uh, craving Ana so much lately. But uh, GG. It was, uh, it was pretty close, honestly. Like, um, we just needed to push just a little bit more. I know it didn't feel close, but, like, you got to remember, dude. They're 12 seconds on the clock. We need to basically win one fight to be able to get it to the end. So, if you look at it in terms of, like, how many fights you're winning, we were basically one fight behind in terms of, uh, you know, being in that game. But anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. I will be back in the next one. Thank you for watching. And I hope you have a good night. Peace, guys.